Hi guys, it's Borixen. Hello, welcome to my channel if you're new here. Welcome back if you've been here before. Let me show what cat in the way. So guys, today's video is a little bit different than my normal videos. Because you guys know I normally do celebrity crush stories and I do American Girl. Well today guys, we're in the world of combining those two. <laughs> why does she have a kid doll? You read the title, you know why. Guys, I want to say first off, I'm sorry if you can hear something in the background. My dad is watching Westerns. Okay, guys, I thought there was something in my eye. I just watched everything. So, guys, um, this is Kitty, or, or Catherine, my Kit Kit Rich doll, one of them. And today's video is, I'm seeing a full hair, I'm going to be able to word it. Is it odd? Sorry for my refrigerator in the background, guys. Is it odd for me having a Kit Kit Rich doll and being someone who grew up watching Spencer Breslin in movies and TV shows and other things that Spencer was in? And you guys are thinking to yourselves, Borkson, what does Spencer Breslin have to do with American Girl? Do you have American Girl doll hugging her? Guys, if you guys have never, or very, you just were just getting into American Girl, you've never seen the shows or movies. Um, Spencer Breslin's sister, Abigail Breslin, played no other but Kit Kit Rich in Kit Kit Rich, an American Girl. So I figured I wanted to talk and discuss Spencer and having a Kit doll, and if having Kit makes you uncomfortable with Spencer, and if Liking Spencer makes me uncomfortable with having Kit. I'm not going to answer that. For one, guys, without trying to give away too much adult and graphic information about childhood me. Little me, I do think, if you guys are new to my channel or just don't know my age, I'm actually almost the exact same age as Spencer Breslin. I'm going to keep making sure I say a correct name so I'm going to bleep out. Um, so me, you know, finding him attractive and having an American Girl doll is not a surprise. I don't think I'm the first person to ever make this kind of video. So guys, I want to discuss, and excuse, I know I have a large scar under my chin. Everyone points it out. I know I do. Um, did, is it odd to have this doll and find him attractive? Well, guys, if I was little, I don't think Kit was out when I was really, really little. Guys, I didn't have any American Girl dolls as a kid. I probably actually, guys, yes. Having a kid doll and liking Spencer Breslin probably would have made me uncomfortable as a little girl. Because, guys, but you know what? I owe me wanting this doll to an infomercial I seen on QVC at 16. I actually, did, I actually wanted American Girl dolls my whole like life, basically, but my parents could not afford one. So when they were showing you, buy it now, like, look, the Kit Kidridge movie with Abigail Breslin, they were showing clips and showing Abigail herself. And she actually looked looked like a friend of mine, who I didn't say her name on here because he no longer goes by name. Um, Kit in the movie, I don't know if it was because she was played by Abigail Breslin, and that was one of my friend's names growing up. But Abby is their dead name. But anyway, so it kind of reminded me of my, my friend. What was my buddy at the time? No, she was my she was my friend in like childhood years. I'm a few years older, so we did depart for a little while. So the doll reminded me of my old friend. And that's not why I wanted the doll. I just thought the actress reminded me of my old buddy Abigail, who is, for some purposes, no longer here. So don't worry, she's not the one who's like. Um, she just became somebody else. That's all. I don't like to give up my friend's information on the internet. So I think that was really cute. Then Ward looked there and said, Mom, you know, can I have her? And Mom was like, no, Borgson. Like, I am not buying you a doll for this around the house. Like, you're too old for dolls. Anyway, like, I'm not buying you a doll for another one this around the house. I'm like, what do you mean? And Mom informed me that she bought three American Girl dolls and nobody wanted them. I was like, wait, what? Nobody wanted them. <laughs> Borgson wants them. I've wanted an American Girl doll since I was, like, eight. So I do think it's possible my mom may have bought it for me for my birthday or Christmas, planned to give it to me, and then never did or forgot where she put them and never gave me the dolls. No. But guys, I searched her house up and down both houses. A theory came to me where somebody took the dolls or they're at my grandmother's house. And I don't want to get too excited because I never seen the dolls. But 
if they're at my grandmother's house, guys, that means they're in my possession. My dad actually had that theory. We went downstairs to look, and my dad said he thought my mom had dishes brought up from the other house. When I told my dad, my mom told me she bought three American Girl dolls and doesn't know what happened to them. My dad said, wouldn't it be something that box is those three missing dolls? And I was like, oh my gosh, guys, teen me, would you look at me? Ah, little me would be so happy. But guys, I'm not getting my hopes up. I don't think those dolls even exist anymore. But anyway, let's get back to the story, guys, my fridge. Let's get back to the story. No, the question to the big answer is no. Having a kid with doll and finding Spencer Breslin attractive does not bother me or vice versa. I don't mind. <laughs> guys, what I say is, is I actually did not. I don't want any hate. I don't want to make it coming for me as comments. I did not like Spencer Breslin as a young girl. I don't think I necessarily didn't dislike him. I think I actually, as a young girl, was attracted to him, but was so young, I didn't know how to handle that. And I was uncomfortable with it. So I never seen Cat in a Hat because the people think it was because of the cat. It was because of Spencer. I never seen it. I did not associate American Girl with Spencer. And it's okay. Um, not that I hate towards him, I just didn't. I do think I, for a little while, may have had some kind of weird feelings for Spencer Breslin as a young girl. When I say young girl, I don't mean even a teenager. I mean, like, preteen, like, young kid. And it caused me to be uncomfortable with him. I think that is what it is. And, guys, funny thing is, I love men today. So, there's no hate. Because, guys, fun fact, we have a neighbor man, Jack, up the street. Same thing. I started to develop feelings for Jack, and I hated, I disliked him for those feelings. And I felt that dislike even into adulthood. And the funny thing, guys, is that's the man I actually wanted to marry as an adult. So it's pretty funny. Just like them as a kid because I had thoughts about him. I'm not going to go too much into my Spencer Breslin thoughts and dreams because that's just not appropriate when I'm holding an American Girl doll. If you guys want, I'm more than willing to do a Let's Talk About Spencer Breslin video later on. Or we could do a video where I completely, like, talk about him and we can get down and dirty with that but i'm not going to do that with an american girl doll in my arms but you guys know what kind of dream we're talking about if you guys are over 15 you know what kind of dreams i'm talking about and i'm not going to dare say that holding an american girl something so innocent while i'm saying that so yeah i had um very adult dreams about Spencer breslin in my early development years and that's what made me dislike him which you would think would make me dislike kid but it had no effect I mean, look, we're the best mothers and daughters around. I love this doll. So, actually, guys, this isn't a kid, but it's a Catherine. She isn't a kid doll. Well, she is a kid doll, but she's not She's not a kid. And that's why I picked Catherine. Guys, guys, by the way, I can go back to fixing my dolls because Kit was found, by the way. This isn't my kit. Kit was found. Um, Well, she's my kit, but she's not the kit that was in question. It was lost. Guys, she's behind Addie in the box. In her box. <laughs> find her for like two weeks i was even making jokes saying she took off I, her mother once at the hots for spencer breslin and she doesn't want to live with spencer breslin lover like she took off for the spencer breslin lover and took off so i've been making those jokes so she's like i'm right here mama <laughs> okay guys actually this is actually Catherine because she i got her in a thrift store and her hair i think is a little cut one side or both i'm not really sure and she was customized. I decustomized her, cleaned up, and decustomized her because, guys, I always wanted this kit doll. My parents could not afford a kit growing up. My boyfriend at the time knew I wanted a kit doll, and he, even even he even said if he could have afforded it, one or found one second hand, he would have gave it to me. But I love her so much, guys. I coveted this doll for many many years. And I finally got her for my twentieth birthday when COVID COVID happened. So. Yes, guys, I just wanted to make a quick video kind of explaining, like, does Spencer Breslin, I almost said Borgson, I knew I was going to do it up, does Spencer Breslin make it uncomfortable for me to have a kit doll? Or does the kit doll make me uncomfortable towards Spencer Breslin? Well, the fact that I'm very back early in remembering these memories, as of yet, it does not affect me, but it could later on. Trust me, guys, if I could kiss an actual boy and not think odd about it than having a dream about someone. See, Kate's got a, Catherine's got a boo-boo on her finger. Then, no. 
Spencer Breslin has no effect when it comes to the doll. Because, I mean, she wants Spencer Breslin to become her daddy. <laughs> yeah. So, guys, I want to thank you guys for watching this video. I'm sorry, guys. As you can see, I was still talking about Spencer, and I got cut off. I had enough. To, I had too much space in my tablet, so I didn't upload another video. So I figured I'd put a cap on this one. So Catherine's already back um, with my other dolls. Remember, until my next upload video, to comment, like, share, subscribe. Go ahead and hit that bell to be notified every time I upload, guys. Remember, guys, there might be some videos that are for one channel and not for the other. So please keep that in mind. Okay, guys. Bye. Also, if you guys let me do a Spencer Breslin celebrity crush story you're talking about him, comment down below. Bye. Also, guys, remember, no mean comments. Bye.